When the Maybach Exolero debuted in 2005, it was an out-of-this-world concept car that only Bruce Wayne would be able to afford. Well, that wasn't until it appeared in a Jay-Z music video. The $8 million car, one of the rarest and most expensive in the world, got to live out its dream of being driven by a billionaire rapper. Oh, and we're pretty sure Jay-Z had fun, too. Here are all the details about the hip-hop star's rare wheels, and what makes it deserving of its reputation as the real-life Batmobile. According to Forbes, Jay-Z became the first ever billionaire rapper in 2019. So, $8 million a car worthy for a superhero? That's not so unreasonable after all. On the Kingdom Come album from 2006, Jay-Z collaborated with Chrisette Michelle for the song Lost One. The Lost One music video, which was released on his 37th birthday, contained one major birthday surprise for us to enjoy. Jay-Z can be seen hopping into the Maybach Exolero, one of the rarest cars in the world that was straight up inspired by the Batmobile. But what kind of innovative design does it take to bring the Batmobile to life outside of Gotham City? Well, at first, it's gotta be a car that only Bruce Wayne himself would be able to afford, which was accomplished by the Exolero's astonishing $8 million price tag in 2005, which equals over $10.6 million today when adjusted for inflation. Second, it's gotta be rare. Exolero, technically a concept car, has no plans to ever make another one. If the price tag alone doesn't draw wealthy eyes from all around the world, then its exclusivity certainly does. The Exolero was commissioned by Fulda, a German subsidiary of Goodyear, to test out its new Carat Exolero tires. Made by Stola, an Italian automotive company founded in 1919, in collaboration with Daimler Chrysler, the Exolero made its official debut in 2005. The one-of-a-kind sleek black automobile was built on the bones of a Maybach 57, but its original design was inspired by and based on modernizing the Maybach SW38. As for its connection to Batman, the Exolero wasn't meant to be a carbon copy of the Batmobile, but drew inspiration from the Cape Crusader's famous wheels to produce a more modernized and practical version of the car that today's millionaires and billionaires would be happy to be spotted taking it out on the road. It definitely looks like the type of luxury Bruce Wayne would be driving around when he's not sporting a black cape and mask. Now for the third and arguably most important aspect of drawing inspiration from the Dark Knight's signature wheels, the car has to both look and drive like one of the most powerful cars in the world. With 725 pounds of torque at 2500 RPM, a twin-turbo V12 engine producing 690 horsepower and a top speed of 218 miles per hour, the Exolero definitely checks that box, and being able to reach high speeds was one of the main goals of this concept car, since it needed to be able to test its tires to their absolute limit. The car is able to speed from 0 to 60 in just 4.4 seconds, which is even more impressive when you know the Exolero is a pretty heavy car. It weighs 2.8 tons, which is a lot more than some of today's supercars, which are just becoming lighter and lighter. For example, the Lamborghini Sesto Elemento weighs only 999 kilograms. The Exolero also has spoilers that come out of the back when it reaches high speeds, adding some flair to an already impressive vehicle. And of course, to top it all off are the set of 23-inch Folda Carat Exolero tires that started it all. All right, now we know how the Exolero performs on the track, let's take a look at the inside. With black and red leather, carbon fiber, and aluminum accents, it's easy to see that the luxurious interior of this sports car is built for both speed and comfort. If you need any more proof that the Exolero is built for racing, just check out the red harness seat belts and those special compartments in the back made to hold the driver and passenger helmets. The car is actually pretty nice and roomy for a two-door, but it's definitely not one of Jay-Z's family cars. This one's clearly meant for a high-speed spin around the track or a music video, or a music video cameo, of course. However, there's one downside to this epic car. The Maybach Exolero can't reach the same speeds today as it did in 2005. It's no spring chicken, after all, but it's still one of a kind, and there will never be one exactly like it. It might be more of a show car than a race car now, but it still makes an incredibly unique addition to any multi-million dollar car collection. But even though the Exolero is one of a kind and irreplaceable, holding on to it for just a few years is good enough for some people. Jay-Z eventually unloaded the car, and it apparently now belongs to a private collector in Germany called Mechatronic, who's been spotted showing it off at a few car shows and events. But it's not like Jay-Z minds. He has at least 15 other cars in his collection to meet all his high-speed needs. Would you like to take the Exolero out for a test drive? Do you think it looks enough like the Batmobile to earn its reputation? Let us know in the comments section down below and don't forget to click that like button and subscribe to our channel for more great stuff. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.